hello everyone and welcome to my channel well uh, in the last video we did uh, set up a new project by the name Esther and uh, we set up uh, we did set up that project with bootstrap and uh, we created the uh, 404 error page and uh, today in this video we will learn about uh, how to create the loading page so let's get started and I'm just taking you guys back to the visual studio and uh, here so let me just tell you that uh, here you won't have to write any kind of functionalities like we used to do in uh, html uh, in html sites wherein we used javascript and we used to write codes like uh, on page load or on document load the you know preloader will be faded out or it will be you know uh, slide up slide it up so we won't have to write any kind any such kind of functions over here we just simply need to uh, create a file by the name loading and as i have already told you that nextjs uses a you know a file based routing so it will automatically detect the uh, loading page by its name and it will hide the loading page once the web page is loaded properly so first of all i mean just to check whether our design is fine or not we are not going to name it loading.jsx we instead we are making it page.jsx so that we can see how it looks and once the page will be created then we will rename it to its actual name and uh, we will create a file page.jsx inside the app folder and over here we will write export default function loading and inside this we'll write return and let's make it uh, div dot preloader and inside this we'll create another div by the name loader so all right now we'll go to google and uh, let's download some animated gifs loading gifs transparent background transparent background and let's go to images and let's see what we have okay it looks good this one okay this one looks good let's wait yeah this one looks good so let's download this file save images and we will download this image inside the images directory on uh, in the public folder of our project and let's give it a name loader.gif now we'll go to the css just write preloader and the pre make it with 100% and give it a height of 100 vh and make it position position fixed and then make it top 0 left 0 and make the z index about this so that um no one can overload its you know z index and uh, it would be visible at the very top if required uh, or whenever required and uh, apart from that let's make it display flex and uh, justify content center and align items center and inside the preloader we have loader so let's style it as well make it worth um worth 100 percent just make it responsive so max worth let's say 10 rem and let's uh, make the height around uh 3 rem and background 
image will be url uh, go to images and select loader.gif and let's see uh, we are not getting anything because the image file is too large as compared to the loader div tag so uh, we'll do background repeat no repeat and background size cover and background position center and then let's see okay we have got the loader here we can make it a little bit more larger as well so let's see we'll go to the inspect element and we'll select the loader and let's make the okay 20 rem would be or 18 rem would be fine and height loader height let's make it oh it's too large so 7 rem 7 or 8 rem is fine uh, just will reduce it a little bit all right 12 rem so we'll make it 12 rem max width and height will be 8 rem so 12 rem and 8 rem and we have got the loading page now uh, since it's not going away after the loading so what we will do is we'll just rename this page and by uh, we'll just rename this page to loading and let's see what happens okay so it's loading now it's gone if you can see so uh, this web page or this website is fast enough that's why it's not loading the I mean, that, that's why it's not showing the loading page, but uh, whenever there would be any kind of delay in loading the page, then definitely this will load the loading page first. And then once it will be loaded, then it will show the web page. So uh, that's all for today. That's all for this video, guys. We'll see you in the next video with another topic on next year's. And uh, till then, uh, uh if you, if you like this video just you know hit the like button and subscribe the channel and we'll see you soon thank you and have a nice day